Hello everyone, welcome to Bees Cocina. Today we are going to um, be doing a, um, a update on those um, thrift store items that I forgot to mention in my last video. Uh, there were a couple of them that I totally disregarded. I think I left it in the garage and I totally forgot about it. But this is something that you guys need to know because if you have a thrift store and it's near you and um, they do um, holidays events, I think the next one is going to be Black Friday or something like that, where everything is 50% off, it might be worth for you to uh, go and check them out because you never know. It might be something that you might find interest in uh most of the stuff that i found was jewelry and i did find a couple of uh, items that i really really love and i think hi genesis how can i help you all out you wanna go sleep okay let me go say good night to my daughter and then you can continue our chat yeah bye baby mm, may god bless you okay have sweet dreams okay Okay, stop looking in my office and go. Okay, <laughs> I have a bunch of stuff that, you know, that is going to be for them to give for the holidays and I don't want her seeing it. That's why she needs to get out. Okay, so one of the items that I found at the thrift store was this one. It says, for God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son. It's John... Um, 316 and I love it I think it's one of those items that um, if you're a God believer I mean I love it I think it's just it's almost like a, like a farm effect to it and it's almost like a faded out but um, this one's was one one ninety nine, and I have a Ross tag underneath it I don't know how much Ross was selling it but I know that everything was 50% off so it was, it was two dollars I probably only pay a dollar for it so I really, really like this because um, this is something that is very dear to my heart, you know. God is present in everything I do these days, everywhere. He's always present. He's he's part of the of uh, everything I do is because he allowed it to happen. So if you don't believe in God, I'm sorry, but you know, guys, God is a big thing with me. So if I ask something to God, He always provided for me. So. I'm sorry if you feel uh, a little bit offended that I'm talking about God, but that is just how I feel and I cannot help it. Uh, so let's continue on uh, with more items here. Okay. Um, I have this cross. It says, those who hope, hope in, lo in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. And then this is uh, another passage and the Bible so I love it I think it's one of those things that you can just you can glue or put in the on the wall and I love to put it maybe here or somewhere around here I don't know if where I'm gonna put it because I wanted to as soon as you enter the office to be able to see it so I can put it in the side here too I can definitely put it here and that is something that I love okay uh, for some reason my my um little um light um i guess my phone is too big and it broke so i'm using my little stand uh handheld uh, little stand and hopefully that will work and let me know if that works or not okay let's go into the next one and this one was um 199 so it was a dollar too so that that was also a, a dollar i'm i'm game if it's a dollar is definitely worth the dollar definitely and i also added these um i added i added to my tree i added that little bowl to uh, to make it a little bit more festive for the holidays i love this because um most of the stuff that i got in you know is from dollar tree and this is definitely dollar tree all the way even the, the lights are from dollar tree they as you can see they have little lights like pumpkin lights I really, really love it, and I definitely think that is something that you put in the floor because I'm, I'm gonna, probably going to butcher, and it's going to fall, and I don't want it to fall down, so you stay there, okay? Okay, so this is another item that I found. It says, Happy Holiday, and it's like a slate, 
and um, it have happy holidays. And I love the fact that you have Santa Claus on the back here. It's something that I can put like in my desk if I want to. I can put it like this. Or I can put it anywhere. And I'm planning on doing like a, a snow, uh, a snow uh, effect all over the house. So hopefully this will be like a sleigh that Santa Claus is pulling through. And definitely something that is cute. This actually uh, little tree is from Dollar Tree. And I actually got it for free. It's one of those items that um, that um, they put to, to to press to protect. But guess what? You know, I I just um, took it out of the box, and then I just have this little bees uh, pressed down on it, and and definitely it changes color just like the real one. So I love it because I didn't have to pay anything for it. It was completely free. And I got another one too. So if you find those little trees that don't have any more left, grab it. See if they can give it to you because they're going to throw it away anyway. So you're saving 125 right there. Okay, so here we go. Um, this one cost, um, it was $5.99. So I would say it was $6. It was $3 for this. But this is really, really wood. You know, this is not going anywhere. This is going to be, you can put candles in here. You can put pretty much whatever you want. I think that is going to be one of those additions that you can actually you can even put like little uh, um, snowmen uh, like I have here like I have this little village almost like a village here that is so cute so I love it you know I have bees here I have the Dollar Tree little car and I also have a Star Wars little item right there too. So I'm liking it. I love I love the decoration. And this is definitely giving me like such a good vibe. And of course, if you haven't seen it in my TikTok, I actually put this projectile on. And um, I might have put it twice. <laughs> I just realized it because my internet wasn't working. And But I love this because it actually projects to the, the projection is so good. And for 125, you can project outside if you want to, or you can project inside indoor. I mean, you don't cannot see it right now because of this light, the lights are on, but otherwise, you would definitely will be able to see it. Okay, let's see. We got this here. Okay, and the next item is going to be a Hey, this is actually one of the bags that I, that I was showing you before. This is another bag that I found in the garage after I did my video. So here goes. Um, this one have like a little angel inside. I'm going to open it. This one says that it's $2.99. So if it was $3, it was $1.50 for all the items inside of the bag. And obviously, I thought they were good enough. But when you do go to the first, first store, be very careful with the staples because I got break with one of them. I, I was bleeding for maybe like a couple of minutes and I had to go to the bathroom and all that stuff. So you definitely have to be very careful. Those staples are very, very, very sharp and you do not want to get caught like I did. Because that's not, that's not good. It's definitely not, not a good idea. Okay, so let's keep on going here. Okay, so this is, um, we have here a small, oh, this is a, uh, a, a angel, I think it's an angel, angel topper. Well, I'm not sure where she is, but she is gorgeous. Look how beautiful she is. She's playing the violin, and my daughter Genesis wants to start playing the violin. So I think this will be great for her. And then, of course, you have to use a uh, Clorox sanitizer or something to make sure that you clean her or a little bit of Clorox or something just to make sure that, you know, you disinfect it to bring it to your house. But that's just... The way it is and and it have like little um um metal on the ends to this is so cute i love it i think i can even put it here if, if i wanted to let me see if i can put it here and let's see how she well i don't like it there but but she can definitely go in here maybe seriously the sky's the limit i love it love it love it i think that that is going, that is definitely going to work. Okay, so here we go. And then she is holding the violin and she has the skirt and she has this dress that is so beautiful. And this little beads are like, almost look like shining star. And I really, really like it. I mean, I'm loving the way she looks. 
she looks like she is on top of the world and she's ready to to sing and it's one of those angels that are singing but look i can put her here and look how beautiful she look of course i want her, i wanted to for her to open up a little bit more but she's supposed to be an ornament from what i see here because she have a thing that i can put her on the tree if i want to but i can also put her in this place too so this is pretty cool though i love i'm loving this one this is great look at this here seriously i love her okay anyway let's go back to this here and i'm loving the way she looks and for how much was it this was three dollars for 150 i'm already winning because i know that this costs more than 150 seriously she does cost one more than 150 I, i'm almost certain of it so if you put her here and she go there she's going to be beautiful let me put this down a little bit here so you can see how bad her but she's pretty long for being an ornament and she's not heavy except for this it's like porcelain her, her upper torso is uh, um is um it's like um like like uh, i want to say porcelain but i'm not 100 percent sure that she is a porcelain but she looks very delicate and i'm liking it okay well you say sometimes you find treasure in the thrift store and this is the only thing that was here i guess that was the only thing there and that was like three dollars and so she was over three dollars but everything was 50 percent off so she was 150 when i purchased her so this is actually pretty good okay let's keep on going what else did i find the thrift store okay i found these these are like porcelain ones and they were five ninety nine. that was six dollars so that was three dollars for all of these and i I'm a little afraid of the staples to tell you the truth because I really got hurt that time. So I just have to play it very safely. I don't want to get hurt again. So here we go. I mean, this are this are this are very 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 big, and I love the fact that you have. How much did I pay for this? Say price. I know that I probably didn't, oh yeah, I paid $5.99, so it was uh, $6, I paid $3 for it. And I love the fact that, that they have such a structure. This one almost had like, like a little foot on the on the bed, I can't, look at this. But this is cute, it have a very nice design. And I don't even know if they are designer, but I do see that there's a a beautiful design in it itself. So I'm liking it so far. The design looks very cute and intriguing, and I might look it up on Google and see what I found, what it is all about. Then the other one, this one is almost like a blue. I love the blue, and then this one is is it's like a hundred percent. And you can put this in a in a base. You can put it in a, in a, in a uh, doll chain. I think I have a doll chain here that I can put it on and show you guys how it will look if you put it. You can put it in one of these things here. And you can put them all in there to nest together. But you have to be very careful because this one, some of them seem fragile. And you don't want them to break. So this is actually like, you can decorate it. You can put like leaves and you can put like a bunch of stuff. And it can decorate. This is the whole year round. But this was my favorite one. It's almost like a glass stain one. And you can see all the glass and the beautiful things in it. And for $6, I'm pretty sure that this, I only paid $3 for it, but... Literally, I pay $1 per item, so I'm like, this is cute, and doesn't it is not telling me where it was, but I know that this is glass that's been cut and glue and designed to, to shape and beautiful design that you can put it anywhere. So basically, I can put it here. I think I have the other one, the bigger one. The bigger one is better than this one. And this one is the one that I, I'm ready to do because I gave the other one to my mother-in-law so I can put my towels in. So maybe I can put this inside of the towels and the towels will be our next nesting to it in my bathroom. But look at these, this, this beautiful thing. You can just put it on a centerpiece at home. Seriously, it's just going to be one of those things that you're going to love. Let me just put it in here because I don't want them to roll too much. But just be careful with some of this stuff because they are very fragile. 
but look at these beautiful design i love the color combination on this one this one has so many depth depths and different colors of it you can use it for decorating your centerpiece but the, the sky is the limit basically so let's just continue on what else do we have here okay we have another bag here and the other bag is going to be um this is a couple items in here and this one costs $3.99 so I will say this this one will cost two dollars two dollars that's how much I paid for it um because everything was 50% off okay I know I don't have to repeat everything is 50% off but it's so dirty look at how dirty the, these things are super dirty you should wash your hands as soon as you touch these things and of course wipe them with Clorox because they will need it okay well this one seems to have a a little tree in the middle of it oh, a little tree right there and it seems to light up from what i'm seeing here i don't see it but it's so gorgeous they have like a little tree and a snowflake i think this will be great for my table because they have the snowflake that i'm i'm trying to do like a winter lane line and then you can even go here in my little um in my little thing here but first i have to wash them <laughs> i have to wash them first so at least pass a white bio or a clorox wipe but this is cute i can't only imagine you i will have to change the battery but the battery seems like those little ones the batteries that 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 not this one doesn't have doesn't have a battery and i don't think it's gonna light up do you light up uh, I don't think it lights up. So basically the battery is... Oh, it does light up. Seriously. Okay, hold on. Let me just turn the light off so you can see it. I think it did light up for a second there. Yeah, it does light up. Look. Let me turn this light off here. And I can maybe show you guys how it lights up. Okay, there you go. Look how it lights up. It lights up very nicely. You can hardly see it too much, but it lights up. So I don't even have to change the battery. This one is actually pretty good. And it has some writing on it. I'm not sure what kind of writing is it, or if it's an exclusive, but I'm loving it so far because that is delicate all the way. Okay, with the lights back on, okay. I can't put it back on. <laughs> okay, here we go. Lights back on. Okay. What else do we have? Okay, so we have these gnomon. Oh, and I saw it and I love them. He could be an ornament. He could be hanging from your tree, but I wouldn't put it in your tree. He's very heavy and he can fall. And I can see that this, you can put it hanging or you can even put it in a little thing like uh, one of those Dollar Tree hooks. That you put like a like a lantern, but what I love the most is that you can put a little candle in here, and you can see how beautiful he'll look. Let me see if I have any candles here that I can put, like a tea light candles. And I actually have some tea light candles from way back when I used to live in military housing, and these ones were free for me, so I'm going to use them, and they light up pretty good. I think they light up pretty good. Let's I use this one. This is a flameless candle, so you don't have to worry that they're gonna be. They were supposed to be fifty percent off, but we got it for free. It was like a military um when they do a military thing. Oh, there you are. So then we put. Let me see. Put it inside, and then this is how we're going to see. Oh my god! But I have to turn him off. Turn the light off again, so you guys can see it better. Seriously, I should try to. I should get this light to be like next to me because obviously I'm I'm going to be like okay let's see let's see how this look without the light on the back okay let's see here we go oh look this is how I forgot this this is the, the lighting of it oh I love it and you have Santa Claus in the middle. And then you have a bunch of stuff. You have like the, the snowman, Santa Claus. And then you have that tea light on the back that actually lights up. 
seriously is going to be a cute item and how much did i pay four dollars four dollars two dollars for it seriously i love it two dollars this could be two dollars already and this could be two dollars already four dollars i mean one dollars and one dollar i already paid for the item already i love it i think i'm gonna put you here i'm gonna put you with a tea light seriously this is going to be cute in there of course i have to sanitize her <laughs> i have to sanitize you before i put you in there but let's try to do that seriously i am loving this little snowman like i said someone's junk might be someone else's treasure and this one definitely does that so i'm going to do that let's see okay let me put that light back on so you guys can see me better <laughs> Yeah, the light is have to be a little bit in the front. I'm gonna have to try to make it that is close to me because right now it's a little hard for me to try to do that. Okay, so let's continue on and try to do this. Of course, I have more decorations here, and you know, I keep decorating my Christmas uh, theme. <laughs> we'll see how that goes. Okay, so this actually is like an angel, and I think it's a candle. It tells me like it's a candle and it says 50 cents in the bottom of it. So someone must have got it for 50 cents. I don't even know if it opens. Wow, this is hard. Oh, okay. Do you open? It looks like a little snowman, a sn uh, like an angel. Oh wow, this doesn't open. Oh, I can try to see if my husband will open it, but definitely doesn't open. Let's see if I press it down, maybe it'll open. Oh, wow. This is not opening at all. It's not budging at all. It's like stuck in there, like someone just slammed it on the bottom and it's not coming and opening. It says, Susan's fall and I don't know if she's a designer or anything like that but I guess it is a candle inside I can feel there's a candle I'm gonna have to open it because now I'm curious and I am so interesting and I'll if I get to open it I'll let you guys know what it is but that's it that's it for that little little bag let's keep on going on the next bag then let's see how much stuff I didn't think I, I, I left so much stuff but I did buy a lot of stuff from the thrift store so definitely okay so this is a ornament that i saw at, at walmart so this was 198 i think at walmart so and how much are you okay this one is telling me that it was 3.99 so it was two dollars so i have this one like a little owl that looks beautiful because I can put him in my table if I'm doing that um, that um, snow fall theme. You know, it's like a let us know. That's what I'm trying to shoot for, and that's precisely what I'm doing. This actually is cute because uh, I wish it was silver. It would have been better for me because silver will actually go better with this one. But it is what it is. I can always paint it silver if I want it to. I know this is for the Dollar Tree. I think I believe I saw this at Dollar Tree. And it's not bad for one, 125 plus 198. And then I have some ribbons here. These ribbons are like a bunch of them ribbons. So you can make bows or whatever it is you want to make. And I think, how much does it say that it's, it's originally? It, I don't see a price, but it does say it's 155 feet tall total ribbon so it's almost like a michael stuff that you wear for you guys i love it because you can you can never not need ribbons you know ribbons are always like part of decoration of crafts or anything else that you have to do i really really like it so that's to be a nice thing to do okay so do i have anything else that i have to show you guys because obviously i forgot a lot last time i don't want to forget anything else because then I'm gonna feel bad that I forget anything. So definitely no. I show you guys that. I show that. Okay. So basically, this is it for the 
for the thrift store um, halt and the things that I missed showing you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I mean, my thrift store has so much stuff and everything was 50% off and I didn't even go very early because it was um, it was uh, Veterans Day and my husband had an event at the girls' school, so definitely I did not have time. But when I did go, it was like around 10 o'clock in the morning and I hear that people get there at six o'clock just to get the, the very best stuff, you know, so that was actually pretty interesting. And I spent a little bit of money there, but I have to say that I also love everything that I purchased. I bought a lot of stuff. I even bought this, this too here. I bought this little tree here. You remember that tree that actually was broken? I was able to attach that little um, bird to it and now it's back to complete and basically it's an ornament actually but i'm not going to use it as an ornament i'm definitely going to put it in here and this way the ornament will not break again but that's just part of me being me and i really really love this here this is actually pretty cute and it's something that you can put anywhere because it's an angel and i have to say that even at church you can donate it to church if you want to it's one of those items that is cute as a button and I, I'm loving it already. Anyway guys, I'll see you next time on Beast Cuisine. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. If you like thrifting, let me know. I'll do more thrifting. I definitely enjoy going to thrift store and be able to find those goodies and be able to enjoy every minute of it. So I'll see you next time on Beast Cuisine. If no one tell you, especially just the way you are. And I'll see you next time on Beast Casina. And everyone, thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm almost getting there to the 500. Uh, my birthday is in two days. So I'm hoping that I reach the 500 by the two days, but I'm not sure if that's going to happen. It would be a nice uh, birthday present to myself. But but you keep helping me. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Uh, keep sharing, subscribing, um, sharing with all your family members. And definitely this snowman is so stinking cute oh my god look at the hat too it's just adorable i love it 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 love it anyway guys i'll see you next time goodbye